I think a lot of information has been coming out about concussions recently as far as the long-term effects. Um, Andrews Institute Rehabilitation is on the cutting edge as far as this type of vestibular rehabilitation. Uh, we take them through several different tests, see what provokes their symptoms, and then from there we develop their treatment plan. Um, the treatment's very individualized. Uh, certain people are stimulated by different head movements. Balance and proprioception is more of an issue. So based on what we find in the assessment, we determine our treatment plan from there, and then we take them through very sport-specific activities and things that will get them back on the field or court faster. Fairly recently, there's been a shift in the way we deal with concussion as far as the rehab goes. There's a lot of research now that suggests that treating it more like an orthopedic injury with special considerations for the concussion, it challenges the patient in a, in a more targeted fashion. So historically, vestibular rehabilitation therapy has been used for a whole bunch of other vestibular problems and it's only been relatively recently that we've started using it for post-concussion. The vestibular system is very important in our sense of balance and a lot of times with concussion that vestibular system does get a little bit damaged. So our, our goal is to treat the vestibular system almost as if it was an orthopedic condition, keeping in mind that special considerations for concussion of course, but to challenge it and to help the brain almost recalibrate its sense of balance and, and position.